promotions have you wrestled in the United States? So, if I can remember a few, um, I'll start with a few in North Carolina. There's uh, ACCW, which is Atlantic Coast Championship Wrestling, uh, WCEW, World Class Extreme Wrestling, Piedmont Championship Wrestling, uh, there was Tennessee State Wrestling, there was a company, uh, Mid-Atlantic Mid Wrestling, there was a, uh, FCW, Florida, Florida Championship Wrestling. Just kind of, um, there's a, at that time, there were a lot of indie, and there are now actually, there's another boom, but there were a lot of indie promotions that um, you could work every day if you wanted to. There were so many companies. So I remember when I was younger, I would just drive from city to city to city, go to a different state, and do like a loop, basically. And uh, usually Sunday night, I would go home. And then Tuesday, I'm wrestling again, basically. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Yeah. Very different life from Korea. Yeah. That doesn't take toll on your body, no? Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, well uh, when, you're, when you're 18, in 19, 20, 21, it doesn't matter. It was okay. Yeah. Is there a promotion you uh, especially enjoyed wrestling in? Uh, I cut my teeth in ACCW. That was where I debuted, or debuted uh, Atlantic Coast Championship Wrestling. Uh, my favorite company, though, it was a very small company, but some of my best friends uh, were the owners and the bookers. Um, so Piedmont Champ Championship Wrestling. Um, I love wrestling there, not for the actual wrestling, but after the show, we would get together, we would go out and have dinner, we would share stories, have fun, drink a little bit, and, and it was always something I looked forward to. The other places you go, you wrestle, and you just drive to the next town. But for that company, uh, we were very close, 